your second final together in New York. Jamie, I'll start with you. Two players you know well on the other side of the court today. What did you know you needed to do well and what was going through your mind there at the end? Um, well, I mean, like, they're super dangerous players, a lot of firepower. I think, uh, I think, uh, I think they uh, came into their own a bit in the, in the second set. Um, but, you know, we had to hold strong, we had to get out a couple of tough service games down the stretch there. Um, I think we did well to keep, uh, get the hang of this now. Uh, it feels like to me. Uh, but look, we're super happy to win. Amazing opportunity to get to play a Grand Slam final again. That's for us what tennis is about and, you know, can't wait for tomorrow. Okay, Bruno. I want to rewind back, yeah. The people love you guys here, first of all. Unbelievable fan support for both of you. You've had quite the ride the past six or seven weeks. For those who don't know, you had appendicitis, had your appendix removed, were out for several weeks. You only started practicing a couple of weeks before the US Open. Uh, I guess you're feeling well. Are you surprised to be in this position? I'm very surprised, to be honest. <laughs> the less he practices, the better he plays. <laughs> well, listen, I mean, first of all, thank you guys very much for coming. Uh, it was it was a deja vu last year we played uh, the semis here on a rainy day on Armstrong with no one and it's such a better feeling to have you guys here so thank you very much for coming uh, and yeah it wasn't it wasn't an easy one uh, couldn't play Olympics uh, I went to Japan to get my surgery <laughs> uh, didn't, didn't play anything in the summer uh, I mean, stay patient, that's all I need. Uh, a lot of support from everyone, from my team, my family, Jamie. You know, we came here, we did you know, the best we could. Not much preparation, but what we said, you know what, let's go out there and let's fight. There's not much to do, there's no rhythm, there's no practice. Let's have fun and fight, and that's, that's what we did. And I think we improved a lot throughout the tournament. Uh, we've been getting better and better every round. Got my son here with me, so I guess I'm taking the energy for him. From now one more to go, huh? it's in the finals, anything can happen, it's just really, really true to be in another final together here. It's been so much fun to watch, and Jamie, Rom, Salisbury next, two other guys that you guys have seen before. What does the Suarez-Murray pre-match ritual look like? What do you guys do to get ready? Play football with Noah. Yeah, we play football with Noah. Football with Noah, okay, that is the key. And, and finally, you two also enjoyed watching you play starting in 2016 for those few years. You were apart for a little bit of time. You're back in 2021. Is this a case of reunited and it feels so good? Yeah, when we play like that, it's great, yeah. I mean, we just, it's been such a stop start year for us for various, um, you know, various things going on in, in our lives, especially Bruno. Um, and, you know, this is why we came back together. We wanted to, to win big tournaments, feel like we're turning up and we got a great chance to win and you know, for us the opportunity to play in the Grand Slam final again, so exciting. We're excited to watch it. Best of luck you two. Jamie Murray, Bruno Sarah, moving on in New York.